Well, the Browns wrap up the NFL draft here in Berea on Saturday. They end up making nine draft picks, including six on Saturday. We're going to recap the entire thing pretty simply here. Mary Kay, what was your favorite pick? You know what? I don't know if it's just because of that amazing press conference that he had, uh, but defensive lineman Perion Winfrey, uh, he was just my favorite pick today. I think in large part because I've been watching a lot of film of him, a lot of clips and highlights since he was drafted today. I watched him at the Senior Bowl uh, and I saw him firsthand there and he is a mauler. I mean, you want to talk about getting to the quarterback, be afraid NFL quarterbacks. Uh, this guy uh, can do a lot of different things, but one of those things is uh, to bull rush and to maul and to get into that backfield. So I would say he's my favorite pick. Ashley, what about you? Well, Perry and Winfrey's a great answer. He had an all-time press conference with us all. So if you haven't watched that, I would encourage you to. But my favorite pick, I'm going to go with Cade York, the kicker out of LSU. We obviously have been lobbying super, super hard for Cade York to be a Cleveland Brown. And at the end of today, he is. So really, really glad they went ahead and made that pick. I'm going to go with David Bell. I think those are both great picks. Those are probably the two that I would have chosen if I had gone first or second, but I'll go with David Bell because I think he's going to be good. Now, is he going to be like a big time number two receiver or, you know, thousand yard receiver? I don't know, but I think he's going to be a good player. I think he's going to be a productive player. Uh, I think that's good value at number 99. The Browns kind of waited that out and got a guy that they obviously like. Okay. Biggest question here after the draft, the biggest thing you're wondering, Mary Kay. Well, lo and behold, it's about <laughs> Baker Mayfield. Here we are, we got to the end of the weekend and Baker Mayfield is still on the roster. We kind of thought this was gonna happen when talks broke off last night with the Carolina Panthers. That was going to be their best chance to trade Baker Mayfield. It didn't work out. They couldn't figure out the money. Nobody really wants to pick up that $18.86 million salary. So he's still around. The Browns are going to have to figure out what to do with him from here on out. Will they find somebody to take him off of their hands over the next couple of weeks? Or is this going to drag on for quite a while? It's going to be uh, stay tuned as Berea turns. And let's be honest, Ashley, maybe you've got something here, but that's, I mean, that's really the answer, right? Yeah, it's exactly. I was going to say mine's kind of expanding on what Mary Kay just said. And if Baker Mayfield does hang around a lot longer, if that's going to kind of morph into a big distraction that this team has to worry about if he, if we get to that point. So everything Mary Kay said, plus that in a worst case scenario is my biggest question. Yeah. And look, I've got nothing to add. I mean, that is it. That is the topic coming out of draft week. And I think that kind of encompasses the whole situation because the Browns had a pretty good draft. It was pretty efficient. I think it was everything they wanted it to be, but like Baker is still here. And as long as he's here, it's going to be a topic in mini camp. It's going to be a topic maybe in training camp. It's going to hang over this organization until he's gone. So there we go. Uh, full coverage of the draft at cleveland.com slash Browns.